Hello, how to solve for s and y in this equation s plus y is equal to 12, s y is equal to 12. Then from here, s plus y is equal to 12. Let's call this equation 1. And s y is equal to 12. Let's call this equation 2. From equation 1. S plus Y is equal to 12, then S is equal to 12 minus Y. This is equation 3. Now let's substitute this equation 3 into this equation 2. That is S Y is equal to 12. Then when S is equal to 12 minus Y, we have 12 minus Y bracket Y is equal to 12. Now let's open the bracket. 12 times y, this is 12y minus y times y, that is y square is equal to 12. And this is 12y minus y square minus 12 is equal to 0. Now let's rearrange this by multiply all through by minus one. We have y square minus twelve y plus twelve is equal to zero. This is a quadratic equation which can be solved using quadratic general formula. We have y is equal to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus four ac over 2a and from this equation a is equal to 1 b is equal to minus 12 then c is equal to 12 y is equal to minus bracket minus 12 plus or minus square root of minus 12 square minus 4 multiply by 1 multiply by 12 everything divided by 2 multiply by 1 so this is y is equal to 12 plus or minus square root of 144 minus 4 times 1 times 12, that is 48. Divided by 2. Then, y is equal to 12 plus or minus square root of 144 minus 48, that is 96, divided by 2. y is equal to 12 plus or minus square root of 96 is 16 multiplied by 6 divided by 2. Now y is equal to 12 plus or minus square root of 16. This is 4 root 6 divided by 2. Then y is equal to 12 over 2 plus or minus 4 over 2 root 6. Y is equal to 3A1, 3A6, 3A1, 3A2. 6 plus or minus 2 root 6. Therefore, y1 is equal to 6 plus 2 root 6 uh, or y2 is equal to 6 minus 2 root 6. We've gotten the value of y. Then let's solve for s using equation 3. From equation 3, s is equal to 12 minus y. Then when y1 is equal to 6 plus 2 
root 6 s is equal to 12 minus 6 plus 2 root 6 s is equal to 12 minus 6 minus 2 root 6 s is equal to 12 minus 6 this is 6 minus 2 root 6 this is s1 also when y is equal to 6 minus 2 root 6 this is y2 then s is equal to 12 minus y now s is equal to 12 minus 6 minus 2 root 6 now s is equal to 12 minus 6 plus 2 root 6 s2 is equal to 6 plus 2 root 6 therefore S1 comma Y1 is equal to 6 minus 2 root 6 comma 6 plus 2 root 6. S2 comma Y2 is equal to 6 plus 2 root 6 comma 6 minus 2 root 6 this is the final answer we can check to confirm if this answer is right or wrong let's check to check from equation 1 s plus y is equal to 12 let's check you see s1 y1 then when x1 is we have 6 minus 2 root 6 plus y is 6 plus 2 root 6 must be equal to 12. This will cancel this. 6 plus 6. 12 is equal to 12, which is true. Then we can also check using the second equation by using this S2 and Y2. From equation 2, sy is equal to 12. Then we know that s2 is 6 plus 2 root 6 multiplied by y2 is 6 minus 2 root 6 must be equal to 12. 6 times 6, this is 36 minus 6 times 2 root 6 that is 12 root 6 plus 2 root 6 times 6 that is 12 root 6 minus 2 times 2 4 root 6 times root 6 that is 6 that is 4 times 6 we have 24 must be equal to 12 so this is 36 minus 24 because this will cancel this must be equal to 12 36 minus 24 this is 12 is equal to 12 which is also true i hope you enjoyed the video please don't forget to like share comment and subscribe to my channel thank you bye bye